Hey guys, welcome back to Dark Souls and a Windows Era Noise, because that always happens. So, we're back into Dark Souls 3, and uh, I have somewhat realized that there's a few complications with streaming Dark Souls. If you've seen the previous parts in the VODs, turns out Dark Souls 3 is not as optimized as I thought it was. And, uh, well, the videos got really laggy during gameplay, and that's not very good. But, but I fixed the problem, so today is going to be lag-free. But also, Dark Souls 3 is not really sort of in line with the rest of the content on my channel, so I'm feeling it's a bit out of place, but I still want to sort of uh, go through it and explore it and all of that, sort of like a gamer encounters. So today I'm going to be streaming Dark Souls 3, and it's going to be, uh, well, I'm just going to see as much as I can today, and uh, we're going to go from there. And of course, if you didn't tune in last time, I have my very own Estes flask right here. And basically, this is not an alcoholic beverage, this is filled with lemon tea. And, uh, well, I take a drink whenever I feel like I need a break, and also uh, when I die. So, if you'd like to join the drinking dying game, go ahead. Ah, and that's gonna sit right there. Alright, so... Why does it keep making the windows air noise? I, I gotta turn that off or something, that's really bad. <laughs> but, I've got my PlayStation 4 controller working with Input Mapper to get it to think it's a, a Xbox controller. And unfortunately today, and since the last stream, the last stream I did, I managed to get online for the first time ever, and since then, I have not been able to log into the Dark Souls server ever again. It's it's just not working. It, it doesn't want to log in, uh, and uh, so I'm gonna have to play offline. Because the Dark Souls servers are still not able to cope with everyone playing. And plus, this is the first weekend with Dark Souls being released, so I think the servers are pretty overloaded. I don't know why games can't prep for this. I mean, they, sh they should have some estimated sales figures and usage numbers. Oh well. Let's go continue. Now we're jumping back into the game, and I've done a few things, which... Uh, just, I've done a bit of farming since last time, and I basically... All I did was I farmed up a bit, to be able to level my strength to 16 and my dexterity... Actually, no, just strength to 16. So I gained two, two levels just from farming outside. I didn't go anywhere. And I also bought this halberd. Now, if you remember, uh, I used to have this. I was using this spear. And this spear is pretty good. It's the starting spear. You can block, you can stab, you can do a big stab. But the, my problem with it was there's no area of effect attack. There's no sweeping attack. So, I went ahead and bought this halberd, which is uh, somewhat better in damage and stuff as well. Which means I still have a poke attack, but I also have this. And, most importantly, if I take off the shield, it has the poke attack, but... The swing attack becomes this. An all-round 360 attack. So I gotta practice swapping the shield out. And actually, can I... Yeah, okay. So, I'm also getting slightly better at using this heal thing, where I swap to this, heal with this, and then swap back to the shield. Like that. So that's pretty good. Alright, but... I started with a fire gem, and since this is probably going to be the weapon I use for the rest of this stream, I want to talk to you. Ah, well, Matt. Tis good to see ye in good health. What needs smithing this day? Now, uh, there shouldn't be any lag. Basically what I did was I stopped streaming in 1080p. It still says it's high CPU usage, but it shouldn't be lagging too much uh, at all. Because, uh, well... 720 sort of fixed that. And I also upped the graphics back to max. It wasn't the graphics settings, it was just resolution. So there's some performance issues with Dark Souls and resolution. Anyway, let's uh, go to Infuse Weapon, and I want to infuse the Halberd. Oh, it costs souls as well. Okay, so I can't afford to do it. Never mind. But I also got um, a Titanite Shard, which also it costs souls. 480? Okay. So I gotta go Pretty get... Careful. Gather some souls before I can reinforce my weapon. Now, how do I go to the next area? I came from that side. I think I'm supposed to go to this side? Is this an... No, that's not a... Where's the way out? 
we're not sort of a... Actually, I know what I want to try. Remember that uh, crystal lizard dragon thing? Let's give that a shot. Let's travel. What's the high wall of Lothric? Oh. That's new, right? I haven't seen that before. But I want to... Uh... Is this the... I think this is it. Cemetery of Ash. I'm gonna go back there. Yeah, it's via... Oh, the... it is the bonfire to go to the next area. Okay. That high wall of Lothric is the next area. But I just want to give this... Lizard a shot one more time With my new weapon And also I should get a couple more Souls so I can actually upgrade my weapon Okay, here we go Now this swing attack is gonna be very very nice because I can just Yeah, we're doing more damage. I think it's down here. For that lizard. Yeah, it's down this way. Let's see if we can actually kill it. Uh, probably not. <laughs> but I want to try. I want to see the difference from last time to this time. And there's actually an item right in the corner there. We might actually at least be able to grab that item. Oh, that was not good. Alright. I'm still warming up. I haven't played since last time. Not besides some farming. Oh, I, I misclicked there. Okay, okay. Gotta be careful here. I think we're doing okay. Oh, damn it, that was... What? <laughs> that was not fair. It hit me twice. Oh. But we got it down to half health. I, I was just careless. I was just careless. Let's try that one more time. Okay, we respawn right here, so it's gonna be fine. Huh. At least we got that item in the corner. <laughs> I'm not sure whether this lizard is actually tougher than the first boss or... If it's just uh, a different attack pattern. Okay, there's my souls. Oh, gotta be careful about that. Okay. The range is actually very good, isn't it? On the halberd. 
Why does it keep unlocking? Okay, okay. Just gotta be careful here. I need to be more aggressive with these things. Like that. Oh, was that a critical or something? Okay, we're doing pretty good, we're doing pretty good. Oh, that was not good. Come on, it's almost dead. Yes! <laughs> Did it! Got a titanite scale and a bunch of souls. That is pretty good. All right, fantastic. <laughs> so we are actually getting better at the game. It's good. How's the stream looking, by the way? Is it lagging? Not lagging? Is it smooth? I hope it's smooth because I tried a lot to get it to work properly. All right. Whew. Thank you, black and yellow, <laughs> for the compliment. It's smooth as well? Okay, no lag? Fantastic. Let's head back here. Travel to the Firelink Shrine. I want to upgrade my weapon because I've, I want to see how that works. Putting on fire, fire damage, I think it takes away from the, the physical damage and makes it sort of fire. I'm not sure if the total damage goes down or not, though. So let's find out. I got the required souls, though. Ah, you. Alright, infuse weapon. So what happens if I do this? 1, 2, 5, plus 17. It goes to... Basically, physical goes down, but fire goes up. Oh, it sort of lowers the physical damage. Yeah, you see the attack power? It goes from 108, well, 162 physical to 108 and 108 fire. Does that mean it does 208, I mean 216 for things that are vulnerable, well, susceptible to fire? I think it is. Generally, I'm thinking infusing an element onto a weapon is considered a good thing. So I'm gonna do that and see how that works. Fantastic, fire halberd. And can we actually do the reinforce thing as well? Do we not have enough souls? No, I have enough souls, but you can't reinforce additional... Oh, I don't have a titanite shard? I thought I did. Pretty be careful. I don't want to see my work squandered. I thought I had a titanite shard. Do I have a titanite shard? Oh, I need more of it, is it? It's not just one? Ah, just one. If I want to reinforce this... Oh, it requires two, okay. Pretty be careful. So, my weapon now has... It is a fire halberd, right? Yeah, it says fire halberd. Alright, let's move on to... Actually, I think I can level up. I don't know what stat I want to level up. Very level very up. Okay, because 2,000 souls should be enough for... Yeah. Okay, uh... What do I want to boost? Do I keep boosting strength? Dexterity? Vitality? Vigor? I start with pretty low in endurance. What affects poise? 
Is it dexterity? Or maybe I should just boost strength. Because it increases our defense. And I think we'll need strength in the long run anyway. That's fine. Farewell, Ashen. May the flames guide thee. Alright, and just to keep things organized, I'm going to take a quick break to split off that crystal lizard. And then I'm going to come right back very, very shortly with uh, the next part. Alright, stick around. I'll be right back.